Hello everybody, this is Tauntaun here and welcome to another Tauntaun talk show. So the only news I want to give about today is the upcoming movie masterpiece number 11, which is Ratchet, which I expected to be released during this year, might be around the end of the year. So that he will be the final members of the first Autobot teams in the Transformer 2007 of Michael Bay. So what is this nice about this figure? At first, I'm going to show you the robot mode. So here's his robot mode and as you can see, clearly see that this is the color variation of him during the first Transformer movie and also the second. Which means that we might have another Dark of the Moon coming. So we have a six pack Optimus, a double gun Iron Hide and a white green budget. And that will be the robot mode. And again, this is the transformation. So during the transformation, you can see that they obviously they capture that spinning move of Ratchet in the transformation. So here's the transformation in the first movie. And here's the transformation. So as you can see, that is really nice. Really nicely done. And they also included it to us three accessories which I'll come in detail right now so first we have the guns so like I said this is a very movie accurate gun but to be honest I thought it would be longer I wasn't expected to the gun to be this short but I guess that is fine and to attach the gun it's like just bring down the hands and they attach onto the wrist the same as style screams so the gun details are quite interesting we have the same colors of yellow green or something some silver and some blue stripes and moving on we have some missiles this is quite interesting because i did not remember seeing that Ratchet has the missile arms that is a new thing to me i wasn't expecting it and then we have his bus saw so to connect to the bus saw is this is still the same connection you just tap it onto right to the hand this is fairly simple and that is this about the accessories so here we have the vehicle motor Ratchet. The vehicle motor is also interesting because as you can see from this picture here, it has two colors. First is the yellow green colors and the second is the pure green. This is kind of a highlight because the pure green is only on the doors. As you can see also a lot of painted, really nice painted details of the virals and everything. You can see that this is a ambulance, a rescue vehicle. Uh, and that the ties made from rubbers and can I can clearly see that. The glass of Ratchet, the glass of the windshield, I think this is kind of like a bluish white color. It's just not like pure white, like the one with jazz, but I can find the blue here. That is really nice on that. And up on the top, we have a lot of gears and everything for the rescue mission. And that, I really adore that. The light also look nice, and especially the flashlight in front of the cars. Yeah, those are really nice detailed. And we can see a little hook over there as well. I mean, this vehicle form is really nice and you can also store the gun on top of the vehicle if that is what you want to. The articulation wise, I'm not going to do it now because I want to save it until for the actual review when I got this figure. But anyway, that is really nice. So that will be it for today. So I hope you guys enjoyed this update and I really promise that I will try my best to get this figure as soon as possible so I can do the review for you guys and also start screw as well. So that will be called the completion of my Transformer 1 lineup and I'll see you later. Ta-ta now!